going ahead people are not optimistic you know the sense what we have seen today is that everybody feels the rupee is going to depreciate further against the usd and numbers being talked of are 70 72 75 and even 78 so you know these the situation is people are talking of lot of pessimism right now primarily on account of petroleum macroeconomic factors like if you are looking at the trade war so if and the ongoing elections which are likely to come up so basically for us as a company we feel that there will be lot of lot of surmounting of mountains to be done you know in the sense each and every component which is imported whether in jpy inr or euro is going to become expensive for us passing on that cost to the customer is not going to be easy right because we are working in a perfect environment there is lot of competition so for us i feel is a time whereby it will be very challenging where we'll have to go in for cost cutting of every kind because this definitely is a scenario where we have no option but to look at our own cost because it's going to hit our bottom lines as i said jpy is one of our key concerns so whenever there's a movement like this inr moving to 69 against the usd automatically for me the yen also becomes expensive so which means my imports from japan my imports from us my imports from any other country everything becomes expensive and my import component is as much as 35% of my selling price so managing that element becomes difficult this is one part my business which is printing inks the domestic part also gets hit by crude prices because all my raw materials are basically derivative of crude so means for me it's a double whammy from all sides pricing although there is a lot of pressure but we are unable to pass on 100% so yes i feel 12 months going to be a very big challenge primarily on account of currencies